can access your books by opening a book from the library or by pressing the reader icon in the favorites bar. When you press the reader icon, a list of recently viewed books will appear. A book will automatically open to the last page it was on. Its title and author will display at the top of the reader screen. All touch action on the reader must be done using your stylus. Touch the toggle at the top left corner of the screen to switch to the reader shortcuts bar. To navigate through a book, you can press the forward and back buttons beside the reader or touch the navigation tools at the bottom of the screen. The previous page arrow takes you to the last page you were on. The first page arrow will take you to the very first page of the book. The back arrow takes you back one page at a time. The next arrow takes you forward one page at a time. The last page arrow skips right to the last page of the book. Touch the number bar to jump to any point in the book. Or use the number pad to type in the exact page number you want. Touch the previous pencil icon to go to the previous annotated page, or the next pencil icon to go to the next annotated page. To see more options, touch Menu. The File menu provides actions that apply to the entire book. Adding a book to your library allows additional functions, such as Highlight and Annotate. Touch Book Info to show the book's table of contents on the tablet. The table of contents will also display any annotations you've made in the book. Press 1 to go to that page. Annotated pages can be saved as PDF to device storage or emailed. The Edit menu has functions similar to a word processing program, such as Undo, Redo, Copy, Paste, and Cut. Delete Annotations removes all annotations from the current page. If you use the Text Selector tool and select a word or phrase, you can then search for it in the book, dictionary, Google, or Wikipedia. Settings allows you to customize your margin and font sizes. The View menu offers options to optimize how you view your eBooks. The most basic zoom tools allow you to zoom in and out. Zoom Select allows you to zoom on a specific part of the page. Fit to Width resizes the page to fit the reader screen. Use the arrows on the Reader Shortcuts bar to scroll the zoomed page. Fit to Page returns the page to its original size. PDF Reflow rearranges the text of a PDF to make it more readable. Use the Refresh Screen tool to remove ghosting or pixelation. The Tools menu gives you options for writing and drawing on the reader. The top half of the Tools menu has the basic reader tools. To view the page in color on the tablet screen, use the Snapshot tool. Tap the page once to view the entire page in color, or drag your stylus over a specific area. To use the tools in the bottom half of the menu, first select Annotate. A check mark appears indicating Annotate Mode is on. To view any annotations you have saved, you must be in Annotate Mode. Use the pencil and paintbrush to write freehand on the page. For more precise lines, use the Shape Maker. or the ruler tool. The rectangle select tool selects any strokes made with the tool. Once selected, the area can be moved, resized, cut, copied, or pasted. Use the eraser tool to remove annotations or markups such as highlights and attachments. In the color menu, you can select the thickness and color of the annotator tools. For additional help with the reader and annotator tools, you can access the user manual by touching the help icon. A guide will appear on the tablet screen. Select the hide menu button to return to the original reader screen. To quit the reader app, touch file, then quit.